Good evening, my loves. This is Jean Vietnam Mani, and I wanted to know what are you doing right now to make you happy? Are you happy in your current relationship? Are you happy being single? Are you happy being married? Do you think marriage is overrated? Because I was once married, and um, even though I love my ex-husband to death, I just feel like a little bit of it is overrated, just a tiny bit, only because you know, people talk about it so much, what it is, and, and you know, they don't talk about the stuff that you have to go through. They don't talk about the struggles. They don't talk about how much work it is. And sometimes you get caught up in that. So in your relationships, whether you are married, single, divorced, or dating, know that you are still your own person. Know that you still have to do things to make yourself happy. Do not get into the monotony of, you know, doing the same thing over and over, going to work, coming home, going to bed, making sure the kids are okay. You guys hang out on the weekends, you hardly don't talk, you know, you're just together for the bills, together for the kids, whatever it is. But know that you have to do something to make yourself happy as well. You can't just be in a marriage because it's cheaper to keep her, cheaper to keep him, whatever the case may be. Um, you cannot be in a marriage because of the things that you have, houses, cars, assets. Of course, it's beautiful when you're building it together and you both feel the same way about one another. You both love one another unconditionally. You got that Will and Jada love. You got that Barack and Michelle love. Now, that's dope. That's what I'm talking about. However, if you're just with the person just because of what they can do for you or give you, that's not right. And karma will come back to bite you in the booty if that is what you are doing. But I'm sure that's not the type of person that you are. I'm sure that's not what you're doing. However, I just had to say that. So in the chapters of my book where I talk about um, marriage, is marriage overrated? Um, being, you know, dating a single, dating an emotional roller coaster for all my singles out there. Um, single life and uh, divorced. Now what? Have you had a dose of divorce yet? So which one are you? Are you single, married, divorced, or are you dating? Or are you just doing you right now? Are you dating yourself? Are you happy with the point that you're at right now that you, you've reached in your life? You gotta ask yourself that. And before you can build a relationship with anybody else, you gotta make sure that the relationship that you have with yourself is strong, is solid, and is built on a good foundation. Because when you're good and you're happy with yourself and you can roll solo or with a group and still be happy and love yourself the same, that's when you have reached success in your personal self, in your personal relationship. And you won't need a relationship. All the things that you start, that you want will start to mag, um, excuse me, you become a magnet for all the things that you want in your life and things will start to magnetize, right? Glue. Because you've given up, you've released the need to have a relationship. You're open to one, but you don't need one. You know what I mean? So, um, Feel free to stop by and watch my um, videos on YouTube. I have like over 70 um, right here. And also uh, my Fit Sexy Life page on Facebook. I talk about uh, fitness, health, wellness, entrepreneurship, business, parenting. Um, you name it, I probably talked about it. Been through a lot. So when you go through a lot, you know a lot, right? So what hasn't killed you, you know I can only make you stronger. So keep believing in yourself and the person that you want to be, the person that you want to become, and you will attract people, places, and things into your life to make your life even more grand than it is. But just be true to you first. Peace and love. Have a great night.